Well, hello all. My name's David, and you are welcome to David's boardroom. Come on in. In today, I'm going to do a short mid-month special here at David's boardroom, just to answer a couple of your questions and to clarify what I do and what I feed my birds during the breeding season and how I color feed my birds. In these next few clips, you will see how I prepare and what I give my birds. Basically, what you will see, it's a general egg food and then I mix either soak seed with it, I mix either petite pois and I mix eggs of which I put into a microwave and break up. I also use a pear mold of which is soaked and you will see in this wee video coming up. I hope you enjoy. So here I have my, my egg food mix. This one this time is straight egg with my ordinary egg food, the soft food. Basically this tub here has got three full eggs in it and I put it in the microwave, scrambled it all up. I mix the two together and And here we have my egg soft food mix. This will be fed to all the birds that are feeding young birds that are not being color fed. So what I do with this, I then, so what I do for it with this for birds that are being color fed and my young birds that are starting to molt. Half of it put into an order and remember this is given every day, twice a day, fresh. I have been asked how I give colour food. Here, little pepper pot, caramel red in the pepper pot and a light sprinkle on top, just enough to cover the top of the egg food. All is mixed in and keep this in a way so there's no cow for red gets into it. And that is my mix to colour feed my red factors. As you can see, some of the egg being moist is starting to turn red now. The whole colour going a, a pinky colour. I'll show you a difference in a second once I get this mixed up. So here we have making sure it's all evenly mixed in through so the birds when they're eating it they're all eating an even amount of the caramel red through the food. Set the two side by side. See the difference in colour? We've got a reddish tint just a pure yellow for the non colour fed birds. That is what I give my birds on a daily basis. Twice a day, on a daily basis, mix fresh. I'll show you my next mix, which will be the soft food mix with soak seed. I do a soft food mix along with a pearl morb. So there's three different types. I'm sorry, and we also do a soft food mix with green peas. I'll show you them in the next one. So as I previously said, I have four different egg food mixes. This one is the soak seed with the dry egg food. Soak seed has been soaking a couple of days. You see it's starting to sprout, coming on nice. Add in the egg food. And I mix it up. And same again, for my native birds, the only difference is I add in some mealworms to it. So this mix, and that's just simple, that mix is my egg food soup, soup seed mix. Given for, made fresh every day and fed twice a day. 
So on one day, I'll have a soak seed mix. Next day, I'll have my pure egg mix. Next day, I will have the green pea mix. And on the fourth day, I will have a, a pearl morb. And I give them all that throughout the, throughout the week on different days. So here, I have my pearl morbid and soft food mix. The pearl morbid has been soaked sort of one on one. It's nice and spongy. What we do then, we mix the pear morbide, mobile, whatever way you like to pronounce it, and with your soft food. Whatever brand of soft food you use, most of them all come all quite the same, different brand names. We all like different stuff. So mix that, mix it all in the three. The same as I do with the soak seed, the same as I do with the egg. Mix it all in to the soft food. This again is mixed daily and is given to the birds twice in a day. Mixed fresh and given fresh. That's how easy it is to get your pair mobile soft food mix. Great stuff. Parents love it for feeding the young birds and when the young ones come out of the nest it gets them started. Next one I'll be showing you will be my soft food and peas. <coughs> and the same again, the same as this Soak seed for the colour food, a little sprinkle on the top, mix it in, that's my mixture for colour feeding all of my birds. My young birds from my first round we're all getting this now. Soon, all my breeding pairs will be getting it. We're soon fast approaching July. Breeding season will be coming to an end and all the birds will be starting to go into a moat. They'll be needing the cow for red and their egg food. The cow for red and the pair mobile egg food mix. Ready to feed to all birds. So here's my final part of my soft food. We have a regular soft food, right, three scoops. And this time we have petite pois, green peas. Those are frozen peas, took out, they're thawed out. And then I just mash them up a little bit, breaks them all up. Like so. Some of the bigger birds you don't really need to mash them up, but with the canaries, the small for the small finches, I just break it up. It makes this better and with the egg food and moistens up the egg food nicely. So a quick a quick breakdown, don't need to be broke up completely, and then I get my saw food and I mix the saw food onto it. Give it a good stir around. Mix it all in. Continues to break up whatever peas haven't been broke up and gets an even mixture of my egg food and petite pois. This, like all my other saw food mix, is made fresh in the morning and also given to the birds twice a day. Nice and fresh, good, clean, healthy soft food. So that's my petite pois soft food mix. I 
and like all the other mixes I have, I'm halving this because I need I need this amount for the birds that are feeding young birds that are not being colour fed, and I'll have this. This is for my young birds that are being colour fed. Same again as in the last ones. My, my wee salt shaker, a small sprinkle on top of it all, and mix it all in. <coughs> mix it all in so it's evenly spread, evenly throughout the egg food. So the birds, whenever they eat any part of it, maybe left a pea or a single piece of the egg food, they will be getting a small bit of the carol for red into their system. And this has been given to the birds fresh twice a day and it keeps them all even, sort of ensures that the young birds and all the birds get evenly colour fed. Stick your own wee pattern and it'll help. <coughs> so there, that's, that's it with the carol for red in it and one without the carol for red. This is a small pinky tinge of the egg for the carol for red one. So, that's the four different types of egg food mix that I use to feed my birds during the breeding season. And here we can see the soft food, the non-coloured stuff with the petite pois and the mealworms. That is the mix that I give to my native finches, my suskins and my red poles when they are feeding young birds. Same food as the canaries get, the only difference is there's mealworms on it. That was just a wee short mid-month special here at David's Bird Room. At the end of the month I will get these back again and I will let you see what has been happening during the full month of July. The breeding season is coming to an end, you will all see, so please call in again at the end of July and I hope to see you all there. Take care everybody, bye bye.